Hello wax packers and welcome to wax packing. This time I'd like to show you how I store and display my wax pack collection. First of all, I'd just like to say, if you're new to wax packing and like what you see, why not consider tapping that subscribe button and help support the channel. Tell them, Wilma! <laughs> okay, so starting with the top shelf, you can see my current wax box display, all in custom built cases, all well protected. Let's take a closer look at one. It's He-Man. You can see the cases are very well made. Um, I normally put some clear tape on the bottom to protect against scratching when they're standing up and the backs slide out there. You can see how snug they fit. Slots in there very easily and then the back goes on. I also store flattened wax boxes bagged and boarded in comic boxes on the lower shelf. And when it comes to storing wax packs, these boxes are just great. So these are the storage boxes I use by Lights, which I'm assuming is German for good box. And as you can see, the wax packs fit perfectly in there. Good solid dividers, plenty of breathing room, nothing's going to get damaged. Everyone looks incredibly happy. Let's take out a Dallas and you'll see how I do the individual packs. So each one gets popped inside a Ultra Pro team bag with an Ultra Pro regular sized top loader just in the back there, just to support it a bit more. Don't want any bubblegum breakage, not on my watch. Thank you. Um, so there's some great protection on there. And you also get to see what's on the back. Nothing, nothing gets covered up. I do use the standard size trading card dividers as well, but they're a little bit small. They get slightly swamped by the wax packs. So I pop each one inside a regular top loader and then I'm free to write whatever I want to on top there. Moving over to the left hand side of the room, more wax box display cases and behind these I keep my boxes that I don't really want to flatten down um, and ones that don't have display cases just to keep them safe and below is a rumpus shelf which I keep a lot of my stuff for videos for prepping and, um, uh, and photos for Instagram. Heading down amongst the toys a lockable cabinet full of trading card sets and my folders. Lockable, very important with young children because my two would rip through this lot like feeding time on the Serengeti given half a chance. The little angels. And finishing up on my trading card display frames which I have cunningly adapted to display wax packs. Let me show you how I did that. So these frames display individual trading cards. Each one in its own plastic holder, as you can see here. Now, if we open that up, I'll take the card out. You can see that the back one here has indents. So we're going to take all of these out, separate these, keep the back ones, and with the help of our old friends, the team bags, get some wax packs situated.
So I hope you've enjoyed this video of how I store and display my wax pack collection. Please check out my other videos if you haven't already. Oh, and don't forget, tell them Wilma! <laughs>